What is up, YouTube? Beard Jester here. We got a haul that we're going to go over. I have my entire haul. I got one haul now, and then we'll do one. Uh, I went back uh, for a second round. I might do that video again later, a little bit later on tonight and then upload it tomorrow. Uh, so we'll have two haul videos for you. Just going to go over the items that we got. This may be a little bit of a lengthy one, so hopefully you enjoy. Um, some decent items, some not so good items. It just varies. We picked up a lot of stuff. Um, we did do books. I'm not really going to showcase the books. Uh, we could maybe do like that a little bit later or something, but I at least wanted to kind of jump on here and show y'all our haul. Also, football, baby. Um, drop a comment. What's your favorite football team? Mine is the Rams. I guess you can't see it because I got my hat backwards, but I am a Rams fan. So, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and jump straight into our haul and kind of show y'all and showcase some of the items that we are picking up. Uh, this is not a recommendation for you to pick up. This is just what we're picking up for our store Whether it's a good sell through bad sell through this is still what we're picking up to try selling So first things first we have Union Bay. So these do have some paint stains on them uh, I don't think that's gonna hurt it for selling it actually might help it from selling but everybody knows Union Bay uh, So just some cargo shorts not a bad little sell. I've been having decent luck with the uh, with Union Bay, so we are starting to pick up a lot more like uh, coats and stuff like that getting ready for the winter. Um, so you're going to see a lot more coats. It's hard to tell what the sell through rates are going to be for coats this summer or this winter. So we're just getting ready. We're prepping. So this this one was a nice like heavy denim, uh, very, very nice uh, like cotton inner. This is a uh, fashion, the art of uh, cowboy guaranteed uh, i don't see the size anywhere on here but we'll probably just go off of measurements anyways this is the tag uh, we couldn't really see any comps on this particular one but man this was a nice jacket it was really hard to leave it back so we went ahead and picked it up uh let's take a look here so we got just like a basic t-shirt here this is a, a rome romey r-o-m-w-e r-m-o-w we picked up a few of these shirts. We really picked it up for the back print. Uh, we'll probably put this as the lead uh, graphic there. Just like a nice little Tokyo Dragon. Uh, this is the tag. Not the not the best. <sighs> I'm going to buy a new webcam because I don't like how blurry it is sometimes. Uh, just some uh, Ralph Lauren boxers. Or not Ralph Lauren. These are Polo Polo by Ralph Lauren. Yeah, so medium size boxers. I was looking, man. The Polo boxers have a pretty decent sell through rate, and uh, they look like they did pretty good. So, oh, it has a little tag on the back too. Yeah, so just some Polo Ralph Lauren. I think everybody knows what that tag looks like. Um, probably ten bucks. Looks like what they were selling for. Uh, not the best. So I didn't even look these up. These are like some hot topic, like cool looking, dangly uh, pants. I guess whenever you put your leg in there, maybe it'll stretch out these little things. But this is hot topic, small. Um, taking a chance on these. I kind of like the style of them. I figured it would sell, but I've honestly never sold anything from hot topic, believe it or not. Um, even still. Now, this is something I've sold, just a Columbia PFG uh, sportswear fisherman uh, shirt, uh, performance fishing gear, vented, just your run-of-the-mill uh, Columbia sportswear. Anytime I see these, I pick them up. I think that's hard. Yeah. Y'all know what Columbia is. I don't really need to show y'all that. Uh, let's see here. Iron Co. So I've been doing a little bit of Iron Co. Um, this is probably like the third or fourth time I picked them up, and I've always sold them uh, pretty quickly. These look like a decent size, size 40. I actually might try keeping these. Um, yeah, just Iron Co. Just your run-of-the-mill Iron Co. brand, size 40. Uh, cargo shorts. Uh, we still pick up shorts, even though we're getting close to winter. I pick up the cargo shorts uh, left and right. We do a lot of jeans, too. So these are uh, a Ramark genuine jeans these are like work jeans didn't really find any great comps on these but i like the size they're 34 34 
Um, and I'm almost positive that we'll sell these for about 15 to 20 bucks. Um, and I think we got like two or three of them. So just, uh, that's the, the brand there. A R M A R A M A R K genuine jeans. And we found like a lot of them. I think we found like three of these. So it should be just some good work jeans. Um, keywords will sell those probably put some keywords in there. I think this is the same 34, 34. Was pretty satisfied with picking these up. Just your run of the mill jeans. This was an Adidas. This is an Adidas, uh, like light top, short sleeve shirt. New with tags. Still got the tags on here just from Adidas. It says thirty dollars XL. Uh, just your run of the mill basic athletic top. see here so gold label round tree and york fitted size 16 so i i always pass these up i normally don't even put these in this is just basic color solid gray i normally don't even really put these in but i was like man this looks really nice and i actually looked up the, the comps on them it wasn't too bad i was surprised um had a decent sell through i think uh, so we went ahead and picked it up. Normally I skip right past them. I might actually start putting a few more in the, uh, in the basket while I'm going, if they're, if they're pretty nice. This is three rivers, um, like a denim, maybe a chamberet, uh, like just got like a whole bunch of like stars patterns. It's really not the nicest. Uh, I didn't look this one up. I think the wife did. Don't know the sell throughs on that. Little St. Louis Blues, <clears throat> Reebok, uh, 39. To my knowledge, most of the sports stuff don't have the best sell through. So either you're going to sell it or you're not going to sell it. So I guess we'll see if we're going to be on the sell side. Uh, these are 524, two super low Levi pants, 9M. Kind of got like this nice little red tint to them. Should sell these pretty well. We pick up almost all Levi's. I don't even look up the prices or the sell through anymore. I just pick them up. Either I sell them or I don't. Uh, these are encrypted, size 18. I did not look these up. I think these were in my wife's basket. They just got a little bit of distressing on the front. These are a little skinny, um, but we we tend to do pretty pretty all right on the skinnier stuff. It just varies. Vigos we do pretty good with, and skinny and American Eagle would do pretty good. Uh, just your run of the mill North Face shirt. Say I'm going to stop picking these up, but lo and behold, I keep picking them up. It's not that they don't sell. It's just they don't sell for much. I feel like I sell them for like <clears throat> 5 to $10. Uh, these are 514s, uh, 34, 32s. I like black. Black is one of my uh, favorite color jeans to sell. So these will these will do pretty well. These are like our just, these are our bread and butter. Jeans are, are definitely our bread and butter. My wife found these. This is a great find right here. So these are a pair of Cinch. Uh, Cinch Grant jeans. Uh, 35, 36s. So even a good size. Really good condition. Uh, Cinch is a great brand to find. Uh, really, really, really happy with this find. <clears throat> I didn't look up prices, but I'm sure we'll do plenty good on those. Uh, let's see here. Uh, this is the other, this is the third pair of those jeans we found. So we found three of these, went and picked them all up. The, so whenever you find multiple of the same item, the listing process is just easy, right? It's three listings. Boom, 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 boom. Copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste. Boom. You did three so fast. So even if it doesn't have like a good sell through rate, sometimes I will still pick them up. If I believe I could sell them. They have good factors, and it'll just be an easy listing. Uh, these are Nike Golf, size 36, uh, just like Chino, run of your mill uh, golf pants. Didn't look up the comps on these. I just picked them up. Normally, anything Nike Golf I run with, Nike normally doesn't have the best sell-through rates, but Nike is one of them brands. This is uh, this is like some more of the just skinny American Eagle Outer Super Stretch. These are AO, AEO denim uh, jagging ankle. <clears throat> we do we do quite a bit of American Eagle outfitters. These are like 
everywhere. I cannot go to the bins and not find these. So they're super light, super easy to pack, super easy to list. And I, I could just copy one of my listings and get it up like super quick. So uh, this is a Penguin Sport. Kind of like a nice, weird looking print. I don't know. It almost looks like an old man shirt. So Penguin Sport. I like picking up Penguin in general. Um, not because my buddy's nickname's Penguin, but I like picking up the brand. I feel like I sell it every time I pick it up. So, um, yeah. Uh, I believe these are vintage Levi's 38 shorts. Um, <clears throat> 560, 38. Uh, these are definitely... Dang, it's got like an orange tab on the back. I, I don't think I've ever seen like an orange tab. I'm kind of learning about like Levi's and stuff like that. Um, and this is definitely like a uh, vintage like bat wing tag. So it's kind of faded. So you can't really see the exact dates on there. But these are definitely vintage. <clears throat> All right. So this is a London Fog. So when we first got started in uh, clothes, the very first item, very first thing I listed uh, was a London Fog trench coat. Um, and it did pretty well for us. It took forever to sell. But this is a pretty nice jacket. It looks like it has a small hole here in the back I didn't see. But I don't think that's going to stop it from selling. It's really nice uh, quality. London Fog, probably not the best. But like I said, we're getting ready for... Uh, getting ready for winter so a lot of the jackets and stuff we're going to start picking up it's going to be really hard to tell what the sell through rates are for some of that stuff until we get to winter so we're just picking it up getting ready and hopefully we'll sell a lot of it during the winter is what we're we want to have a good queue for so this is a nike uh sportswear small thermal um the reason i got this is because it's like the thermal knitting uh i think that'll sell should sell pretty quickly <clears throat> So these are Nine West Vintage America Collection, 1834 Waist, Vintage Straight. Looks like a nice pair of jeans. I didn't look these up. These were the wife's find. So why is it like take a minute to – is it because of my face or what? I see people like put their hand up. Is it like – man, this webcam sucks. Let me try to – no. Okay. Buying a new webcam. I'm going to order one tonight because I can't stand that. That looks like that. It's actually going to drive me a little crazy. Um, so we found this. This was a really nice one, man. This is a Perry Ellis portfolio lambskin jacket, right? So I saw these new selling for anywhere two to four hundred dollars. I did see some used ones selling anywhere between thirty to a hundred dollars. Um, it looks like it has a little bit of the uh the leather kind of fraying here not not much not much but there's like a little bit of leather fraying i could probably patch that up with a little bit of leather work but man this was a great find even with the leather issues i guarantee i'll get 50 bucks out of that easy easy money baby all right diesel power xl a little flannel uh diesel i like selling diesel i don't know if this is actually like the diesel brand of pants, but diesel power. Uh, didn't even look it up. Just picked it up. Uh, so North Face Men, size 32. Like athletic board shorts, kind of. Yeah, these are board shorts. Uh, hiking, outdoor. I normally pick up almost anything North Face. Y'all know this. This is a Worldwide Sportsman XL Fisherman. Uh, vented, kind of like the Columbia PFG, uh, except this is a, a pretty big size, too. This is nice for XL. I think this will fit me. Shoot. Might have to keep this. Uh, so, it's got like a worldwide fisherman. Man, dude, I'm going to stop showing y'all because that's embarrassing. I just bought this. I just bought this uh, webcam, too. I didn't even look at the specs. I should have looked at the specs. Uh, so this is stuff I normally won't pick up anymore, but this is just like a regular Nike light hooded uh, hooded uh, like athletic outdoor running style thing. It's pretty basic. It's hard to sell the basic stuff. Mark Anthony. I just got this for the color. 
Seltzer didn't look too bad for the polos. Um, and I just did short sleeve and like almost all of them were polos that came up. So didn't see really many. I probably should have just did t-shirt and, with the short sleeve, but Mark Anthony, it's all right. Uh, so this is a brand. Oh, this is Eddie Bauer Sport uh, nylon spandex. Uh, like I got these because they were kind of like a flare on the bottom, but it does have like a stain down here. We're going to try to get out. Um, normally, I don't pick up much Eddie Bauer, but these had like some factors to them. Eddie Bauer Sport. I don't. I actually didn't look these up. I just picked them up because they were flare and athletic, and they were leggings for yoga. So just kind of ran with it. 569 Levi's, 3432s, bread and butter. Uh, looks like maybe straight leg boot cut. Um, yo, so I found this, right? I found like this like cool looking print. It just felt different to me, right? This is all embroidered on here. So this is 3J Workshop Johnny Was Medium. And oh my God. So there was like 30 listed. It is Pearl Snap. There was 30 listed and six, uh, 60 something sold. And they were selling for like really good. Um, really, really good. It's like anywhere between uh, 30 to $60, I think. I was, I was so surprised. I was like, damn, that's good. Uh, silver Jeans. These ones, so I, I said I was going to stop picking up silver, but I think I was looking at these. These are Silver Jeans Elise Straight 2732s, and I think they had a good sell-through rate. That exact tag title is what I looked up, so Elise Straight Silver Jeans. So I'm pretty sure those will sell pretty quickly. Plaid and Plain. I didn't pick these up. My wife did. Plaid and Plain, like your run-of-the-mill like uh, dress pants. Looks like it's new with tags, navy blue, plaid and plain. Didn't even look these up. My wife did. Um, yeah. So picked up this hoodie. This doesn't have the little strings here, but I still picked it up because of the print. It's an Arrow 1967, I think. Has a really nice print, and we're getting close to winter. I'm pretty sure this will sell for like 20 bucks, even without the little strings. More Iron Flex, Iron Co. Size 40. Run of the mill shorts. <clears throat> so, a Wisconsin uh, sweater. Wisconsin Dells. Don't know what that stands for. Picked it up because it's a sweater. Getting close to winter. Picked up a lot of stuff getting ready for the winter. I want to have a good, good, good Q4. So, this is Russell Small 3436. Uh, just like your run of the mill. Just like top jacket, full zip, fleece. Should be like 20 bucks. Polo by Ralph Lauren. Prospect short. Just Chino. Should sell. We got more Union Bay. Pick up a lot of the cargo shorts. A lot of the short stuff in general. This one's uh, Johnny Verato's USA Modern fit 16 and a half it doesn't really have anything going for it but it set the bends it's just like a solid solid like hair but hair bajone hair jabone hair jabone i don't even know how to say that word it's not plaid it's like the smaller squares hair jabone hair bone hair boom bone bone hair jabone hair gone heck i don't know i tried Charles River Apparel. I got this. Getting close. This is a big one. This is a 5X. Um, yeah, really nice. It's just like a, a standard like pullover, outdoor. Uh, probably good whenever it's raining. Style jacket. Should do pretty good for us. Uh, Wrangler. Like I said, I like black jeans. Uh, they normally do pretty good. I think these were 3630s. Yeah, perfect size. I like it around that anywhere 36 to 30s uh sizes pretty good got another little jacket here uh this was acadia just a full nylon like rain uh tag so yeah 
just like your standard, like uh, nylon outdoor, like disc golf tournament thing or a sports t tournament style thing. Uh, so these are Adriano Goldschmied 30R, the Griffin Tailored Short. I like AG. AG is like one of my favorite brands to pick up. Normally sells pretty good for me. Um, I think most of you resellers out there know the little AG. Just some chino shorts. Should do pretty good. Uh, let's see here. Royalty for me. Want a better butt. Size 8. Want a better butt. Always does good for me. I didn't even look it up. I just knew they'd sell. They may not sell. Who knows? I guess we'll find out. More Wrangler. Just running your mill, Wrangler, Carpenter, Carpenter pants. We pick it all up. Uh, jeans just do pretty well for me. And I got, I sell a lot of jeans. Uh, short, sexy series, size 13. We picked these up for the big stitching on the on the back pocket here. Uh, so this will probably be in the photo somewhere to catch the, the viewer's eye. Uh, these are like Capri like style utility 36 uh shorts we pick a lot of this a lot of this stuff up shorts pants run of the mill stuff i'm taking a chance on this i saw this i was like oh man sparkles right heavy sparkly um i was looking up some of this stuff is expensive it's called la femi F-E-M-M-E, -M -M -E, size 4, um, like a strapless, like gown, uh, medium, it's really heavy, uh, so hopefully this sells, I'll probably list this for like 75, maybe I'm cuckoo, maybe I'm not, uh, went to go get my wallet from my wife to pay, because she had the wallet, and I found these true spec, uh, cargo pants, I like true spec, any type of like army, military, police style tactical 11 any of that stuff um really good so this is anna a dot n dot a a new approach don't ever buy this brand i i only bought this because of the pockets another one of them things um has like some sparkly sparkles and yeah hopefully this sells if not then i'll take them out and donate them or sell them a garage sale so this is Foot Locker 36. I don't think I've ever seen Foot Locker shorts. This is a first for me. I also haven't been doing clothes that long, but I didn't even look these up. Just bought them. Sometimes I get in a hurry because we shop too long and don't have very much time to look up prices. Uh, Rock, Rock and Republic medium uh, leggings. These are stretchy spandex. Uh, Rock Republic normally does pretty good for us. I've actually never seen like their their leggings before, so. Even though they sold leggings. Didn't look those up. Probably should have. Uh, Vigos Jagger Jagger J A G G E R skinny 3226. Classic fit. Are these yeah, these are women's. I'm surprised they have them lit. They actually have the length and the width. Um on these Vigos. You saw these probably in my last pickup. I still pick them up. I didn't know about this one. I picked it up because it almost like is like a cool, like thick cotton chaps, uh, Ralph Lauren. I don't know if it's vintage, but it feels vintage. It's a large. I'm going to have to look up. Uh, there's no stains on it either. Really, really nice, like just polo. I don't really pick up chaps that often, but I think this one will sell. I think the bright yellow should catch somebody's eye. Uh, Tahari leggings um hey daughter daddy's doing a video yeah uh so tahari uh large just like your dress pants uh look these up i think they had a decent sell through nothing great not 100 percent. not even 50 percent. i don't know disney uh just a really cool like graphic i was like dang this looks dope I think the graphic alone will sell it. Uh, looks like it needs to be washed a little bit. But yeah, really nice shirt. Getting close to that Halloween time, so I'm pretty sure that'll sell. Uh, these are some Pilcro and the letterpress. So the last time I found uh, Pilcro anything, uh, sold really fast. So Pilcro was really good. 
These are 27 Fitstet. Didn't even look these up. I just saw the name and I bought it. <clears throat> so these are battle uh, like explosion flight academy. I think these are like fighter uh, shorts. Couldn't find a comp on these, but I'm pretty sure that fighter stuff does pretty well. I don't know. Uh, so these are Sweet Suit Petite. Uh, Sweet Suit Petite. I looked these up. I was surprised. I was like, dang. Had a pretty decent sell through. And uh, pretty good prices. I think it was like 39 somewhere in there. 40 bucks. Really nice Abercrombie & Fitch. Uh, thick sweater. I think it's missing the drawstring things too. Shouldn't prevent it from selling. Should sell pretty well. American Eagle Outfitters Slim Long Sleeve. Um, just nice work shirt. Preppy style. Not too bad. Uh, so Rustic Ridge Large. Um, Rustic Ridge. Couldn't find an exact comp on this. But this is purple, and purple always does good for me. So uh, we're getting close to the winter. That'll sell. Another, like, run-of-the-mill hoodie, Levi's. Only picked it up because it's getting close to winter. Should sell. Uh, Lucky Brand. If y'all watch mine, y'all see I pick up a lot of Lucky Brand. A lot of the same brands sell. Uh, Lucky Brand does pretty good for us, so I'm going to keep picking it up. Some people have a lot of luck with it. Some people don't. So I picked up this Batman shirt. Looks like it's new with tags. I didn't even see that whenever I picked it up. Um, kind of like co got costume vibes off of it, right? So we're getting close to Halloween. Looks like it has a back attachment here. Oh, is that the cape? <gasps> Yo, it's got a cape. Let's go. So, that's dope. I like it. Should be good. Should sell good for Halloween. Uh, Slim Skinny, Levi's. These are size 32. Doesn't say what Levi's they are. Like 505? What, what are you here? Doesn't really say. So we'll just do Levi's Slimmy, uh, Slimming Skinny, size 32. I think those are still women's. We're getting close to the bottom here. Uh, J. Crew. I like J. Crew. Sometimes. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I think I should sell it more, but I think it's got a pretty deep market. But these are like leggings. I uh, never tried selling J. Crew leggings, so I thought I'd give it a shot. I probably should have looked those up. Uh, some True Religion. I love selling True Religion. These are size 28. They have like a nice like uh, blue uh, stitch going around them. So I'm pretty sure these will sell pretty well. Didn't even look up the price that I would sell those at. I think it has like a little stain here, but that'll come out. So True Religion is a good brand in my opinion. Aeropostale, just your run of the mill, long sleeve button down. I pick up a lot of that kind of stuff. Just trying to sell some of the similar items out of my store. Hopefully I get some people that want to buy stuff so this is a hundred percent silk double xl bobby chan uh the comps for a hundred percent silk shirt i was surprised that these didn't sell for more and have a better sell through rate uh so maybe bobby chan's not the best person to buy but is that the bins really light still think i will sell it for probably 15 to 20 bucks um this is a really thick jacket here Oh, Old Mill. I like selling Old Mill jeans. Um, I normally have like the lined, uh, like like the, not thermal lined, but the uh, the fleece, not the fleece, the flannel, flannel lined uh, Old Mill stuff. So this is just like a nice like work jacket. Be a good seller, especially coming up during winter. And then, so these are Redemption Denim. Uh... These look so dope, man. These are going to sell really well. They got, like, these awesome, like, flap, like, uh, almost, like, rocker-style pockets. They got these little, I don't know what these things are called. 
they're like studs i think they're studs man these are so nice this is a great find need to be clean though it does have some stains on it but i'm almost certain we'll get those out and then last but not least the final item here lena uomo relax straight 34 34s so i could not find this brand selling very well um 34 34s though they're black i will sell these i, I promise you i'll sell these I don't care if there was no sell through on them or I couldn't find what I was looking for whenever I was in. I was also going pretty fast, so I didn't look up like anything super fast. But these will these will absolutely sell, man. These are great. Great condition too. A nice big black patch there on the back. 100% I'll sell these. Um, so yeah, that was my Ben's haul. I really do appreciate everybody that tuned in. If you did like it, um, and stayed all the way through y'all are true ones. So please drop a like comment subscribe uh, Leave me what your favorite football team is. I definitely want to hear some of y'all's teams out there um, If y'all are doing any fantasy drafts, I got one draft with work going so hopefully that goes well Maybe I'll share my team with y'all one of these days uh, in one of these videos. So um, Oh, I'm sorry. That was 80 items that we bought uh, clothing wise. We did 23 books four DVDs two CDs uh, for like a total of like 109 items is what we got. I think we spent like 150, 160, somewhere around there. I don't have the receipt in front of me. But yeah, either or, I'm out. Y'all have a great day. I'll catch y'all in the next one.